Good evening and welcome to our top story tonight, Unprecedented Ocean Heat, a Climate Crisis with Far-Reaching Consequences. The world's oceans are in the grip of a staggering climate crisis, with temperatures reaching record highs. According to the EU's Climate Change Service Copernicus, the average daily global sea surface temperature has surpassed the previous 2016 record, soaring to an alarming 20.96 degrees Celsius 69.73 degrees Fahrenheit, far beyond the usual levels for this time of year. These rising temperatures pose severe implications for our planet's health. The oceans play a vital role as climate regulators, absorbing heat, producing half of the Earth's oxygen, and influencing weather patterns. But, unfortunately, they are becoming less capable of absorbing carbon dioxide, leading to a rise in plane. Planet warming greenhouse gases in the atmosphere. Additionally, this warming trend accelerates the melting of glaciers that flow into the ocean, intensifying the threat of sea level rise. As the oceans grow hotter, marine species, including fish and whales, are forced to migrate in search of cooler waters. This disruption to the food chain could have a profound impact, potentially affecting fisheries and making some predatory species, like sharks, more aggressive due to confusion caused by the warmer temperatures. Widespread coral bleaching and coral deaths have been reported by Dr. Catherine Lesneski, who is closely monitoring a marine heat wave in the Gulf of Mexico for the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration. The situation is further complicated by pollution and overfishing, adding to the stress on our oceans, warns Dr. Matt Frost from the Plymouth Marine Lab in the UK. What is particularly concerning about this new temperature record is the timing. Normally, March should be when the oceans are at their warmest globally, but this record occurred in August. Dr. Samantha Burgess from the Copernicus Climate Change Service expresses concern over how much warmer the oceans may become before next March. Scientists are diligently investigating the reasons behind these unusually high ocean temperatures. The primary culprit remains climate change, with the oceans absorbing most of the heat from greenhouse gas emissions. The burning of fossil fuels continues to exacerbate this problem, making it more ch. To stabilize ocean temperatures. This broken temperature record has now surpassed the previous one set during the powerful El Nino climate fluctuation in 2016. Although another El Nino has begun, it remains weak, indicating that ocean temperatures are expected to rise even further above average in the coming months. Throughout this year, marine heat waves have struck various regions, including the UK, the North Atlantic, the Mediterranean, and the Gulf of Mexico. The occurrence of these heat waves in unexpected locations underscores the severity of the situation. In June, temperatures in UK waters were 3 to 5 degrees Celsius higher than average, and sea surface temperatures in Florida reached a scorching 38.44 degrees Celsius, 101 degrees Fahrenheit, far beyond the usual range. The Intergovernmental Panel on Climate Change IPCC reports that marine heat waves have doubled in frequency and have become more intense and prolonged since the 1980s. While air temperatures have experienced dramatic increases, ocean temperatures have taken longer to rise, even though they have absorbed 90% of the Earth's warming from greenhouse gas emissions. Now, there are indications that heat stored in ocean depths may be surfacing, possibly linked to El Nino. Though scientists anticipated sea surface warming due to greenhouse gas emissions, the extent of the recent escalation remains a subject of intense research. The urgency to address and mitigate climate change is now greater than ever as our oceans face an unprecedented crisis with far-reaching consequences for our planet. That concludes our top story tonight. Stay tuned for further updates on this critical situation. Thank you for joining us, and have a good night.